when I did experiments in 2011 with inverter circuits and this all had to do with my solar energy system uh, I had to find out how to limit the current to the inverter and um, in that case very low value resistors were necessary so here you see a circuit that operates on 12 up to 24 volts and uh, the inrush current could be approximately uh, 100 ampere or 30 ampere that doesn't matter much but uh, to to limit the inrush current I use a very low value resistor here and you can buy them in professional um, shops but you can also make it yourself such a low value resistor and the problem is that they can be measured with normal hobby meters like these ones they cannot measure in the uh, 0 0.x up to 0 0.0x uh, range that resistance value is far too low to be measured with, an, with a hobby meter but um, there is um, a way to solve this problem when you measure the current, uh, sorry, the voltage that falls uh, over that resistor or parallel to that resistor with a voltmeter or a microvoltmeter you can get an indication from the voltage drop and that also gives an indication about the maximum current that can flow in the circuit. So here I made a test circuit. It's made from a piece of wire that's normally used to hang clothes on and this wire is very well usable as wire, uh, iron wire for a high current resistor. I can't measure it it must be somewhere in the 0 0.01 or 0 0.1 ohms range but I can get an indication by connecting here the voltmeter parallel to this uh, resistor and uh, see uh, which voltage is uh, present parallel to that uh, resistor so Here's my voltage supply and I switch the resistor here in the voltage supply. It has to safeguard my voltage supply to 0 0.03 ohms and now I'm going to raise the voltage uh, to the load and in fact it's shortcutted or in other words we can say the load is 0 0.30 point uh, zero three ohms so I'm gonna rise the voltage now and you can see that parallel to the low value resistor a certain voltage drops and when you study this you can find out uh, which voltage drops and whether this voltage drop works good to uh, limit the current to uh, to an inverter or something or another device that takes a high current. So you have to study it yourself. You can see on the power supply that the current that flows is approximately 6.5 ampere. It flows through this resistor here and it generates parallel to that resistor this voltage is approximately 0 0.3 volts so that's the voltage drop in the resistor parallel to the resistor and when you wind this piece of wire up to a coil to have a uh, usable resistor that can limit um, high currents 
into circuits that ask for a high current.